Good morning, Greenfish Nation. Hey guys, the question arose the other day. John, how do you get so many camera angles on your boat? So today, we're gonna discuss how we get all those great fishing angles. So you guys stay tuned to Greenfish Nation for our camera, audio, video, equipment review. Guys, one of the ways we get those great camera angles is we use five GoPros. Uh, I have the Hero 3s and the Hero 3 Pluses. Uh, those are mounted at various places on the boat, and we'll go over those right now. All right, guys, at the bow of the boat, we have a Hero 3. Uh, it has a uh, mic on it as well. All my cameras are mic'd with a, like a lapel mic that is hardwired to the camera. So this is our bow mount. It catches all the action facing toward the back of the boat. Guys, our next camera is mounted on the uh, front of our driving console. Uh, it catches the action facing toward the front of the boat on the front deck. Also, I can use this on either side of the boat. All I have to do is turn it because it's on a GoPro flexible gooseneck. Guys, this is one of our newest uh, camera additions. Uh, we have this uh, power pole. Um, it goes into your navigation light system that powers the camera. Um, and this camera is at the rear of the boat. As you can see, it's next to the motor. It has a large shotgun mic on it. Also, it catches all the action forward facing in the boat. Uh, this pole is supposed to be rated for 75 miles an hour. Uh, we have tried that out and it will hold up. Guys, we also use two chest mount cameras on the boat. Uh, I just uh, purchased these handy little uh, mounts here. They're magnetic. They work really well. One of those kind of people that hates wearing a, one of those strap on chest mounts like myself. Those little magnetic mounts, they work great. You can find those on Amazon. Uh, this wireless mic system that I have here, I actually have two of them. Uh, these were both purchased on Amazon. This little wireless mic here is two channel. It comes with two transmitters and one receiver. And it'll work with your iPhone or it'll work with a GoPro or an Android system. I have another one as well. This little system here is also a two channel. Uh, it works really well with the iPhone. Uh, this, this one is phone specific. So if you have an Android, you'll need an order an Android type, but both of those are great, great uh, accessories to have. I take a lot of my still photos with this Canon EOS. This is an older camera that I had for several years, but it, it works really great. Um, it's an asset to have. I have uh, just a regular lens and then I have a, a, a zoom telephoto lens. Guys, another thing I have here is I have a, uh, a 4K a video camera. I do a lot of my interviews and a lot of stuff like that with it. Uh, it does not go on the boat a whole lot just because it's big and bulky, but it is a great asset to have as well. Another thing that I use a lot and like doing self interviews and things like that is this Holcomb three axis gimbal. It's also available on Amazon. It's a great steadying tool for you to have. We also use this DJI Pro 3 Phantom drone for our drone shots to get those nice shots that not everyone can can get but we do use this quite a bit uh, and we'll see more of it in our coming videos guys this is our newest addition 
for our drone footage. This is a Holy Stone 720G. Uh, this drone here is considerably less than the DJI. I think I paid about $2,000 for that DJI drone. And this little drone here, I paid 200 bucks for it. Um, I think it does just as good as the DJI myself. But anyway, that's our newest addition to our line of camera, audio, and visual equipment. Guys, I hope this explains how we get some of the footage that we get. If you guys have any questions on where to purchase or prices or anything on some of the stuff that we have showed you today, just drop me a line. I'd be more than glad to have a conversation with you. Until next time, I'm John. We'll see you on video. Tight lines.